All right, drone video for track 18 at the Devil's Backbone Project um, in Howell County, Missouri. This property does um, directly border the Mark Twain National Forest along its west side. Uh, we're looking down at the west side. The, the easement road borders the entire west side of the property with the National Forest um, right on the other side of the easement road. So you've got 200 feet, about 200 feet of frontage, I believe, on this one on that uh, gravel easement road along its west, west side and then of course the national forest right across so we're actually over the national forest we're looking east at the property um, it sits essentially just to the left of that kind of meadow area that you see and it is um, like we said a couple hundred feet of frontage on that easement road goes back to the east heavily wooded property Nice mixture of timber, probably mostly hardwoods, um, but we've seen pine in this area. We've seen cedar, uh, as well as uh, hardwood trees, red oak, uh, white oak, hickory trees, walnut trees. A um, lot of different species of uh, of trees, tree, <laughs> on the on the tract. This particular tract actually did not appear to have. Uh, uh, a driveway or or an existing site, uh, which is the case on which is the case on most of the tracts. Uh, so that's something that if you wanted to do that, um, might be a great way to add value to your property immediately. Uh, it, it lays extremely nicely. Um, looking at the topo map here as we do this, and it's going to be the highest toward the west side. Um, just east of the easement road. From the easement road, according to the topo, it, it rises up very gradually for just a little while, levels off, and then as you go easterly from there, it, it slopes down very gradually. So it looks like an extremely usable property. Some pretty good sized timber on here as well. Um, what, so what we're seeing there, that trail, that is not an easement or anything. That's just an, an old trail. Um, the Devil's Backbone Project had quite a few trails kind of crisscrossing uh, because this was used uh, by the, the former owners or, or owner's family as one large, hunt, one large hunting tract. So they had all these trails. Uh, the, the only easement um, is the easement road on the west side. So no one can, can use those other trails to cross your property. They'll, they'll just grow up and uh, eventually disappear. So Mark Twain National Forest right there. So nice having the National Forest frontage. I mean, it's just, we were so excited about this project because it's, it's extremely hard to find properties that border the National Forest. It's hard to find properties even close to the National Forest, uh, though of course it can be done, but, but finding a tract with direct frontage is just amazing. Uh, and it sets up a situation where, where you can have your private acreage, um, your home or cabin or uh, campsite or deer camp on your own private acreage and and literally venture into tens of thousands of acres of additional acreage that you can use for hunting and camping and recreation and there are trails and rivers and creeks I mean it, it's it's similar to having you know a 50,000 acre ranch uh, in Texas uh, except you're not paying taxes on a 50,000 acre ranch or uh, or anything like that you, you just have your own private acreage and you can uh, go directly into that national forest so it's a fantastic situation we already mentioned um, heavily wooded as you can see so now we're over the national forest and we're looking east you can't quite see the easement road it's just below us and then um, crossing over onto the property gorgeous gorgeous tract uh, after it's been paid for in full, of course, then you could you could cut the timber, you could log it, you could use it for firewood or potentially for a cabin. Um, prior to that, you cannot cut the timber, except that we often are able to, to get written permission for doing an improvement, like a driveway or a building site in this case, or a, or a camping site. So you can contact, contact us for details about that, but uh, we have what we think is a, a really simple process. Um, uh, if, if that's something you want to do. So yeah, get a hold of us. Track 18 at the Devil's Backbone Project, uh, surveyed with the corners marked. Beautiful property, and obviously the, the National Forest um, is right there. <laughs> so a pretty special tract.